This video is sponsored by AOEH.com. Don't forget to use the coupon SHAKO for a 3% discount on your next purchase. Hey guys, welcome to another Diablo Tourist Reactive video. Even though it seems like the ladder is gonna be even more delayed, we all thought that we would have been playing on ladder by now, um, but can't do anything about that. But I thought I was going to discuss the different kind of strategies when it comes to actually making your first ladder character. If you have a preference or a favorite character to play, even though it's a Amazon or a Barbarian or even a Druid, if you actually enjoy playing that, then that is your number one pick. If you're going for, I mean, high-end or end-game stuff, then there are some other ways you can go. But if we're talking about the number one commonly used strategy in this game, when it comes to a first character, there are no one other than the Sorceress. But why is the Sorceress the number one most commonly used character in the beginning in this game? Well, for a numerous of reasons, but the number one reason has to be teleportation. Because when she reaches level 18, she gets teleportation and she can cover a lot of ground very fast in comparison to a lot of walking characters. So that is very important and a sorceress can reach Nightmare and Hell a lot faster than any other character in this game, period. The second most important thing is she is very strong even though she has no gear whatsoever. So she can cover a lot of ground very fast and she is very strong and this is especially good when you're clearing bosses like Mephisto and Anderiel. She can be completely naked and nuke down Mephisto without any trouble whatsoever in hell difficulties. She won't be able to get your griffins or Tyrael's might and whatnot in the beginning, but in the beginning you're not you're not looking for griffins or Tyrael's might anyway, but you can find your Shakos your Stone of Jordans and all these good starting gear. That is why the Sorceress is the number one most commonly used starting character. So what do you think? Am I going to pick the Sorceress for my first ladder character? Take a guess. I give you 10 seconds to enter your thoughts and your guesses and we'll see. Within 10 seconds, come on guys. Put your answer in down below. What do you think my starting character will be? Have you locked it in? Yeah. No, I'm not gonna pick the sorceress. And I'm gonna pick a whole different kind of character based on the first thing I told you. If you enjoy playing a character, then just pick one. If you like a druid, then play it as a druid. I mean, this, it's supposed to be fun. But I have my favorite character, which is also a very strong character that could clear basically anything in this game without any gear at all. And that is the Necromancer. So my first ladder character will be a summoning necro and that is i will be able to clear travicles i will be able to clear chaos century in hell i will be able to clear basically anything in the game from the get-go without enigma without beast it doesn't matter i i'm basically almost clearing clear ubers if i want without almost any gear at all that is how strong this character is and in my opinion it has always been my favorite character to play in the game so if you have a favorite character then play it don't mind what anyone else tells you is the best strategy to start off the ladder this game is meant to be fun to play and pick the one that you enjoy playing the most okay guys hopefully 
ladder will come sooner than later and until then stay safe and stay happy okay peace